Hey, water signs. I'm here to do your June 16th daily. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Going on with my water signs. Ooh, look at that. Knight of Cups. Knight or Knave? Is this the Knight or the Knave? This is Knight of Cups. Someone is crying over somebody very immature. Maybe an immature person is, or you're tired of an immature person. Okay. Or you've been acting immature. Could go either way. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Someone who is working on their empire, someone who is a leader and or an owner of their own company, CEO or something. Okay, Aries could act foolish and immature sometimes too, so maybe you are dealing with an Aries and they are just too much for you to handle. Um, we have the Knight of Pentacles reversed. Okay, someone could be spending unnecessary money. Maybe this person that you're dealing with is spending money on stupid shit and acting foolish and immature, acting dumb about it when you confront them. Like, where, where, where did that money go? Or where did you spend that money at? Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo as well. Yep, speaking your truth, speaking up. Telling them like it is. Like, what the fuck, dude? Or woman? You know? Spitting your truth to someone. Maybe regarding money or lack of money. Something like that. Unnecessary spending is what I'm seeing here. What is this? This is the chariot reversed. Okay, so you're not sure where the money is going oops or you're not sure who or what they're spending it on where it's going to so you're confronting them about it they could be acting immature and impulsive or you and you're trying to decide whether or not you're wanting to get the truth out of them or tell them to fuck off or something <laughs> see how there's a little fish in that cup Hmm. They could also be spending it on someone else and you found out and you're like, oh, fucking hell no. I'm ready to cut this bitch. <laughs> Deciding whether or not to show up wherever they were or whoever they were with. That's some stalker shit. <laughs> Two of Pentacles reverse. So maybe unlikely they were with someone else, but maybe they were just spending money on stupid shit. Or you were thinking they were with someone else too. You thought they were probably juggling or there's or they found out and got caught and they had to let it go or maybe you were juggling two people you got caught because they found out you were spending money or whatever so you had to let it go you had to stop that okay or probably you're probably tired of juggling two people <clears throat> The tower. You guys have the tower. This could be your tower moment too. Ending it with someone because they were spending money on somebody else. Maybe the strip club. You spoke your truth. You make. You can't decide whether or not you want to leave them or not. Okay. Maybe because in the past they were juggling. Maybe they were you. Maybe you're the person that they ended up with when they were in a relationship to somebody else is now karma's repeating itself and that could be your tower moment are you finding something out about someone regarding uh, unnecessary spending being immature someone's having a tower moment mm -hmm. and then we have the seven of swords Seven of Swords, feeling betrayed, feeling like you can't trust anybody. 
ready to fuck shit up, mentally being really, they screwed you over, I'm seeing that. Like, how could they do this to me? How could they screw me over? Your mind is racing, your mind's going crazy, tower moment. Look at that, look what's on the bottom of the deck. Five of Wands. Definitely fighting, arguments, conflict. Could re be regards to a commitment, ending a commitment because of what, what's going on here. Woo, shit. They could have probably cheated on you with a Cancer Scorpio or Pisces, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, or an Aquarius, they were Gemini. Also, maybe Aries, the Sag. But yeah, you guys definitely had a tower moment. Give me an oracle, please, for my water signs. Cancer Scorpio Pisces, please. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. What time is it? Six. What's in? Yep. Look at that. It was like, I'm ready to kill somebody. <laughs> You're like ready to let this go. I'm feeling like you're over it. You're done. It's like you're you're looking to God and like, what am I going to do? What should I do? I'm really flipping out. Someone's flipping out. Praying that you don't kill somebody. <laughs> really wanting to spend time alone to think. Someone want investigation mode. Okay. Yeah, someone's hurt. Someone's crying. I see crying going on. You know this relationship was already dead and you kept trying to push it. Or maybe it was someone you've been with for a very long time. You see the graveyard? Could be a long relationship that's probably ending or you guys are just having a really bad tower moment. Mm-hmm. You're just like, mm -mm, I'm done. I'm over it. Someone's over it. All right, water signs. This was your daily for June 16th. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. I hope this resonated with you. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Love you. Bye.